Hey everybody, welcome back to Kill by Daylight. Survival! The thing that we all must try to succeed in. That's it, you see the memes, right? You see, like, objective, survive. You know, the, that, that hot meme that started at the beginning of the pandemic. Two and a half years ago? Yeah, time is a construct, apparently. Anyway! Uh, we're gonna- we're still on the fucking road, man. We're still trying to do this shit. Iridescent Evader Emblems. And yes, I do realize, hey, it's a lot easier just to do Chaser Emblems. You play as, like, I don't know, Lead- no, Legion's not that good, but he's kind of necessary, right? Because you start chases really easily. And then you can just finish them off again. Start to chase, bap bap, barrel frenzy, deep wound. And then you go back and you, you end that. You get Chaser pretty easily, even if they all escape. You get it fairly easily, right? I guess not. No, because that's a devout metal for sacrifices and hooks. Um, yeah, of course, Killer's going to be way easier to get for any emblem. But that's the point of this, right? This isn't the easy way. This is the hard way. And what makes for a more interesting video? The hard way. Duh. So we're still trying to do this. I figured, you know what? I got blood points to goddamn burn. Let's level up my Nia, right? Trying to figure out who to level up. And I was like, yeah, Nia's got some pretty dope perks, right? Bounce landing is always going to be really good. Well, eh, it depends on the map. Uh, most most maps, this is pretty good. Because well, even if it doesn't have a tall building, it has that, that mountain to jump off, right? The bounce landing is always pretty good. Quick uh, Urb Invasion, I don't know why I keep wanting to call this quick and quiet. Urban Evasion is, is really good for ratting around, so that's really good. And Streetwise is actually pretty, I think, pretty underrated, right? Because at max level, max rank, reduces the consumption rate of item charges by 25% for you and allies within 8 meters. Bring a, bring a, a toolbox, bring a med kit, bring a map, bring a key, bring a flashlight because you're in Nia main and that's what you do. She's got some really good perks. Um. We're, none, we're using none of this f for this first game, right? Uh, I got Quick and Quiet, I got Dead Hard, we got Circle Healing and Shadow Step. I figured if I can set up a Boon and a Shadow Step... Boy, howdy. Or Circle Healing and Shadow Step, I should say. If I can set up my Boon, we got two really good Boons on it. And we we're just basically designed to, like, lose the killer and heal, right? They're not using a med kit because I keep getting saddled with Sabotage 4 hooks as a daily. And I need blood points to level people up, so kind of got to do them. So if we can do that, set up a boon somewhere that's really well hidden, and we can just start chases, then that's fantastic. We have quick and quiet to escape if we need to. We got dead hard for a second chance, and again, boon shadow steps really good. So I'm not running protected gloves because I want the killer to heal hear me. I want them to hear me sabboing the hooks and be like, what the hell? And they come over, start a chase, and maybe can loop them at Shaq. Because apparently, I did research. I looked this shit up because I was tired of just like three hours trying to get these goddamn medals so far. Cumulative. Actually, no. I think four hours. For like an hour and a half the first time, and then I recorded those two videos, an hour each. And then I tried for like another half hour today and be like, fuck this. I gotta look up shit. So I did that, and it's uh, time in chase, and you ha you only get those points if you escape the chase. You get hit, you lose 10 points. That's not a lot, so that's not killing the chase. What kills the chase is if you get downed. So if we loop the killer for a good minute, two minutes, and then we lose them, we get a massive amount of points towards the emblems. That's what we gotta do. We gotta start chases and chases in our favor. If this doesn't work, we have a second build, with dead heart. Oops, okay, fine. It's my secret, not yours. Although it's probably gonna put that uh, on, and I don't want that loadout on. Shot, you didn't see, sh you didn't see shit. You didn't see a ding dang thing. Yeah, you, you, you know, you understand. God, I hope this goes, I hope this is, I hope we, I hope we can do this. I hope, we, I hope we're good here. I hope this is it. We need two more, two more. Behavior, please, if you're gonna do more of these iridescent quality emblem bullshit challenges, just make it... Get one! Do one thing really well. If not, it's the last... I understand it's the last chapter 
of of challenges for this tome. I get that. I understand that. I I understand perfectly. And you got to make it challenging. But did it really have to be three iridescents? Uh, if you were like, get six gold evaders, I'd be like, you know what? We can bang that out in a single session, in a single afternoon, whatevs. You know, a couple, a couple of sessions here and there, make multiple videos, boom, done. Iridescents are infuriating. Like, uh, either make it so it, the challenge is get one iridescent of evader or chaser emblem, or get like five or six gold evader chaser or whatever emblem you want it to be. Battle pass challenges are meant to be fun and intuitive. Please make them fun and slightly easier to do. They should not be a brick wall that people can't get past. I was reading on the forum apparently like a couple years ago, shit was bugged <laughs> and people were like, I, I, I actually saw some from like, like to like recently, fairly recently that, um, what? We got, we got fucking somebody using, who is it? Where is it? Sorry. I'm gonna go back to this loop. That's a boon. Oh, I heard evil. I heard... What? The fuck? Alright. I'm, I'm a sabo, man. We got those the storehouse here. If I can actually... If there's a totem in here. There's a If there's a totem in here, that would be fantastic. This is a big old area. I would like to set up. Mr. Killer, you're probably setting up. I would like to set up as well. There's none, really. Buff. Oh, it's a twins. It's a twinny. Alright. Uh, I would like to set up my boon just because I have shadow step on it. Ah, the bush tricked me. Damn it. Yo, where's a place for a fucking boon? Yo, my homies, where's a booner? Where the fuck? I hear Victor. Shit. Well, shit. Damn, dude. Hear that little baby scream. Ding. Yo, can I get a fucking... Oh. Okay. He's preoccupied. I should be able to set this up pretty pretty easily. Although, this is a pretty obvious place, so... They're running... What the actual fuck was that noise? What? Oh, she got a... Oh, she got a pickup. Oh, shit. We have this over here now. So we have shadow step up, we have circle healing up. Yo, can you guys not? Can you guys fucking not? Yo, hey. Hey, yeah, you. Come get me, please. Please loot me. Why? Why would you do this? Where are you? Okay. The child is out. He can't see scratch marks, right? What the fuck? What? This is the problem. They do not want to... Like, they don't want to fucking... Oh, fuck, I got your baby. Wait, why are you... You're over there, why? Oh, okay, she's coming after me. Get off of me, child! Okay, she's right there. Oh, we, ch we chasing here? Cool, we're chasing. But, bro, what? Um... Yeah, I do have a problem, game. You just cucked me. Every single time, man. Every single fucking time. 
Our chaser was pretty full there. I don't know what that meant. I'm that the fucking things in the corner lie. I dead hearted and I got rubber banded back into her scythe. That's really cool. What's my fucking ping at? Oh. Oh, not as perfect as our uh, Michaela. But no, it's pretty fucking well. Thank you. I'm just gonna fucking heal. That's not a good noise. Is she near me? Am I in danger? I might be in danger. What just happened there? Bruv, what? No, you don't get that. You fucking kidding me? I'm gonna run to my boon. Also, quick and quiet, saved our ass there. Is that? I'd like to start healing, thank you. I don't know how she didn't hit me, by the way. So there's that. Also, wow, two boons on the same fucking team. This area is, like, complete- Come back here! I need you to chase me! Don't you go up that hill! It's not worth it. I want you to chase me. Like, legit, I want you to chase me. You just released the child, you did. I don't hear him. There's a fucking... There's a fucking... Invitation over there. We got somebody. Yeah, you're... Okay, what the fuck? Chase me! God... Damn it. A boon over here would've been fantastic, man. I hear evil. I'm just trying to get my fucking... Exhaustion down. Oh, shit. Oh, she's coming over- This doesn't hit. Yeah. That would've been fucking hilarious. What? Why did you- what? What happened here? Oh! Oh shit! Okay. <laughs> you know what? You know what? I'll take it! Shit! We go back here. We go behind, we go behind our tree and we reset. Right, we have line of sight. If the child comes, we can tell. Can I don't remember what Victor does. I don't recall. Like I have no idea. Can he see scratch marks? I don't think he can, right? He's like Legion. Yes, it's a very weird thing to compare the child to Legion. I need you to actually fucking chase me though. I need a good chase where I drop a pallet on your head or two. You're here. Where? Oh, there you are. Hey, I'm in your asshole. Can you not hit? You're a fucking penis. That's a protection hit. A distraction. Chasing me? Oh shit. I thought she was chasing me, like, that's not... What? If she doesn't get out, it's all for nothing. Guess what? It was all for nothing. This is the- this is the progress, right? This is the process. This is it. We go back to the boon. We have two gens left. I did hypothesize last video that I don't know if you need to escape in order to actually get iridescent, so I don't know if this will work how I think it works. It's fucking stupid I can do this, by the way. Yeah, go to the boons. Go boon it up. You in here? You are in here, you little bingus. Oh, you bro- you... I mean, this is a multiplier, right? No, where are you fucking going? 
I was gonna say, I lost sight of her. She's kind of proxy camping. She's using Victor to find out where everybody is. Hello, Nancy! Oh my... Hello. I'm gonna kidnap your child. You know I can do that? I can absolutely do that. I'm gonna kidnap your child. We're gonna have... Yeah, she's... What? No, come back. God, fuck, damn it. Get off of me, child. There she is. <laughs> Can Nancy. No, get fucked, little one. Yeah, there it is. This fucking Nancy. This fucking Nancy. I fucking swear to God. If she costs me this iridescent, I'm gonna fucking rage. I don't know why she's like up my asshole. Why are you why are you like this? Like I, I swear to Christ, I'm about to lose this fucking iridescent because she's an idiot. She nearly got me got by Victor once. Oh hey, this is this is eligible by the way. This is legal. This is fucking stupid. Did you know that? Behavior. Kote, you knew that, right? You knew that this is this is stupid, right? That Victor being here is 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 camping. You're literally stopping me from playing the fucking game. She's not gonna break it. She's she refuses to break it because why would she? This is this should not exist. Great, I don't get saved because fucking Victor camps. That's that's really sweet mechanic. If Victor is near a hook, his his uh killer instinct should not happen. It shouldn't happen. You just stole a game state away from me. So that's really fucking cool. The Nancy caused me to get down, because I couldn't heal myself fully, because she's a fucking idiot. And... Victor camp, so that's fun. So no iridescent. I'll be fucking shocked. I did it! That's not what I care about, though. Nope. Fuck yeah, bro. How much- Oh, I only got silver! I'm sick and tired of this. I'm sick and fucking tired of this behavior. I was like, oh, I got gold at least, right? I got gold. Right? No, because the fucking twins... Whoever the fuck... I was gonna say, is it fucking actually Dowsy or, or Pixel? No, fuck no. You fucking literally... Oh my god. The Nancy's gonna escape. And that's the mo that's the biggest travesty. Outside of this emblem system. My boon stays after I'm dead? What? What is this? What is she doing? She's hiding in a locker. No, she's... Yeah, she was hiding in a locker! You have to be fucking kidding me. Also, again, we're gonna go back to the same... My same problem with these survivor challenges is it's... You have to rely on other people to complete them. I have to rely on the killer to actually go, oh, I'm gonna chase you. Let's have a good chase. Instead of, I see you, I'm gonna run away and go to somebody else because there's a tile here that I don't like and I don't know how to manage. Do you see the fucking problem? Do you fucking see it, mate? I just wasted a good 15 minutes of my life for fucking Nancy to cock block me. And even then, even then, I still didn't get gold. I still didn't even have a glimmer of like, oh man, if the Nancy didn't fuck me over. 
I was able to fully heal. I didn't get any of that. It doesn't matter what they fucking had. Change these challenges or the emblems. Holy shit. Because at this point, I'm lo I'm losing out on a lot. Nobody, I, that's finished. Don't bring that up ever again. I'm losing out on a lot here. Like, I I bought the rift because there's a lot of good shit in it. There's eight days left. I can get a good good way through. Oops, no, I can't. I'm stuck on this bullshit. Behavior, you owe me money, is what I'm saying. You're putting this stupid shit in the way. Nobody can complete it. I would love to know the stats on these stupid fucking challenges, honestly. And the fact that you're like, oh, Survivor Path is down here, oops, it goes into Killer, and oh, Killer Path is up here, oops, it goes into Survivor, is the worst decision you guys have ever made. I can't even say that because the artist and Pinhead exists. Fucking bro. Like, look at this. Like, okay. Let's do this one. Fuck it. We'll go find my favorite quest in the game. Glyphs. And then it's, okay, do co-op actions. That's not hard. Finish healing three health states of other survivors while using aftercare. That's not hard. And it's like, then it's a killer one? Break 50 pallets, walls, or gens? Or hit a survivor 40 times? Those aren't that hard, but they're still killer-sided. These should be up here, whereas blind the killer 12 times, fully deplete a med, six med kits, be chased, should be down here. Because then it's like my only option to get the two and a half levels is kill the obsession 10 times by any means. That is 10 separate matches, by the way. And I'm, I avoid fucking Moris like the fucking plague, because it's not fun. It's not a fun mechanic, right? I have one. I have one Ebony Mori. Oh, I got Cypress Moris, but ooh, I have to save them for last, and then they get the hatch, and then it's a waste. That's fucking stupid. I, I don't use things in this game that I find to be unfun to go against, right? I am literally using Boon Circle Healing here because I didn't bring a med kit. I normally just bring a med kit. It's that simple. Like this, I'm bringing a med kit and self care to stay alive, hopefully. But it's just like, fuck, man. Your shit needs a change, and I don't think you have the fucking resources to do it. Find white glyphs. And now I'm hitting that point. Now I'm hitting a point in my brain where I'm like, okay, we could do that, but what if? We had that one match against the Pinhead uh, a couple episodes ago. What if I had this on? I would have I would have been two out of three right now. But look at my last one. So now my like I do this all the time in in these fucking games that have battle passes. Like, you know, what? I'm having trouble with this one. Let's do another one. But it's like, I'm having trouble with that. But what if I go off this game? What if I succeed? What if I do good and I get the iridescent emblem? Well, I'm stuck doing fucking glyph challenges. Because nobody has a good brain in their head at behavior. So I'm like... Like is... I can't be the only one, right? That has that. I can't be the only one that's like... Thinks like that, right? Like I do it all the time in fucking Apex Legends. Like, okay, I'm having trouble getting fucking damage or... Uh, getting kills of this person. Let me switch to a different person and uh... Get... Oh, fuck you. And and try for for kills on this person. But what if I go off? Then I'm I'm losing out on that damage challenge. Like that happens all the time. Like I'll stick with a character that I'm not doing well with. Just because there's that slim chance that I may go off and get that 1500 damage in a match that completes the 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 fucking weekly. So that's where my brain is currently at with this game. Like, I could switch to another challenge and do it, but what if? But that's the way my fucking brain works. Also, the fact that 
Oh god, I hate this fucking Ugh. Just everything about how the archives works and its challenges is infuriating. It's like it's fucking specifically designed just to be completed by streamers, and that's it. Inship? Okay. I thought that was Babysitter that did that. I guess not. Oh, fuck you! Really, mate? God damn it. These, these, these challenges are a fucking problem, man. They're a real problem on the survivor side. Cause you have, like, you have to have a game where the killer actually wants to interact with you. If the twins actually, in that game, actually, like, followed me to that loop and I could loop them, cause I could've, it would've been fine. I can drop the pallet on their head, that's a, that's 11 points towards the system. Or 50 points towards the system. Pfft, who cares? But. I, I could have looped them. We could have ran around the loop. Okay, I get hit. Fine, I'll run to another loop. That's fine. I drop chase, or they drop chase, and I get those points. Cool. But they didn't want to. I was like, let's go loop the shack, and they're just like, no. No. Let's go loop over here. No. They looked at me, and then walked the other fucking way. I thought fucking killers chased Nia's out of instinct. What? I've been lied to by the survivor community. It's like, what the fuck, man? The fact that 99.9% .9 of the survivor challenges in the archives is, you gotta hope the killer's actually playing the game. You actually have to hope that happens. Because if not, well, you're fucked. Lightbringer is literally the only one that you can actually get without with the ki AFK killer. Evader, they have to chase you, or you have to stay in their terror radius for, like, the entire fucking match. Apparently somebody said Gideon Meat Plant is a very good map to do it on, you can just kind of linger. So... It's also a very good map, because we have Quick and Quiet, and we can kind of easily lose chase, but I have to find the killer to initiate a chase. Ah, oh, it's a Sodaku. Are you willing to chase me? That no. The the answer is fuck no. Ah, oh, I got a fucking stun on, mate. Rickety wheel. What the fuck is rickety wheel? What? Oh Jesus Christ! That was actually kind of terrifying. Oh, bye. Alright. Pallet's done. Chase one. Wunderbar. That's, that's, uh, man, if I had a boon. What? She's still following me? I'm, I'm, I'm fucking terrified. Where? Is she behind? What the? What the fuck? She was looking at me. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. What? Double layer fucking maps. Oh, that's a little crazy. I, I, I'm trying to be like, where is she? And the... Where? Hello? Okay, she found a Dweet. Lovely. Alright. Fun. 
Okay, Jen done. Hello. I will sit on this Jen with you, Mr. Cheeky Boy. Again, I can't really be a Gen Jockey. I have to go fucking instigate. I'm, I'm oblivious. What? Okay, what is... What does the fucking rickety wheel do? I keep getting the the oblivious status effect. Boons. I keep getting oblivious status effect, but I, is it like when I walk near a TV? That one's already... I... Hmm, I don't know, man. I gotta look that up. I, I do have Sadako fully leveled. There's a pallet break somewhere? The fuck? Yo, I need her. I need her to fuck. I need to find her so she could chase me. Like, drop a fucking pallet on her head. This is me actively looking to bully the killer. Where? Where or where? It's gotta be you're near a TV or she teleports. That's my guess. That's my guess. And that's what I'm sticking to. It has to be when, like, ever she teleports or if I'm near a TV, because it's on currently. Also, oblivious means I can't hear a terror radius. Right? Right? I think that's what that means. So, shit. She could actually... Are you le You are leading her here. Am I mid chase? She chasing me? No, she was not. Oh fuck, dude. We're gonna stick here for a minute. Do we do get like a multiplier for the amount of time we are spent? Don't you fucking touch me. Don't you fucking touch me. I'm gonna loop in here. That does not count as a chase. That did count as a chase. Neat. Okay. We're escape. We're winning chases here, mate. Oh, fuck yeah, bro. Make your choice. Okay. She found the Michaela. Oh, shit. All right. You didn't see, you didn't see shit. You didn't see shit. I'm gonna try to approach cautiously now. Try to remain in her terror radius. I don't I don't know where she is. She's not looking at me. I feel like I'm about to be biffed in the back of the head. Nope, we're fine. Can, can you... Okay, so lesson learned. I'm not saving anybody. Not gonna be saving anybody. We are hiding within her terror radius, and you do get, like, a multiplier for that. I think. Right? Okay, it's absolutely being near a, t a TV. TV is here. So once we move out... Yeah, once we're out of range... Whatever that range may be, that's a fucking bold ass place for a totem. Oh, damn, dude. Gonna run. Quick quiet. That's why I brought it. That's why I bring it. And quiet's really good. She can actually just uh, pop out of here. That's kind of scary. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this. I'm not a fan of that TV. Not a fan of it. Not a fan of it being here.
I take it, I lose my midkit. I don't want to do that. So I'm just going to leave. Man, having the oblivious status effect in this, if it's what I think it does, and that is, you don't hear their terror radius, right? I believe that's what it is. Fine. Oh, invitation, extra blood points, whatever. Yeah, I believe you don't hear the killer's terror radius, right? Is that, is, I believe that's it. We were oblivious next to that TV and she walked into the room and there was no terror radius. There was no heartbeat. But that's what it does on this map. That's pretty fucking good. Especially for a stealth killer. Yes, 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 I know. There's a fucking TV in there. She's chasing the fucking ace. Where? Where? I'm trying- I'm literally chasing the- where? Yeah, oh, we're over there. I'm literally chasing the fucking killer at this point. Somebody dropped that pallet already. Sad. What? What? I'm sorry. No. Me no likey. Also, she's a stealth killer, so... I'm just keep running. I'm gonna keep holding W. She's looking at me. She's a stealth killer that needs to come out of stealth. So, she doesn't have a terror radius normally. Yes, 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 oblivious. Man, shut up. Might as well help this. There you go. Ah, there he is. I bumped into a fucking wall. You like to chase me. Oh, fuck. Oh, that was a stun, too. Oh, I'm oblivious. Oh god, there's no pallet in here. Somebody broke the fucking pallet. I pressed dead hard and it didn't come out. Also, yeah, that fucking thing in the corner lies. Because it was literally just like... It was literally, uh... Nearly full. Three quarters away full. That should be a... Uh, a what? A gold, right? We'll see if it lies at the end, if I only get a fucking silver. Oh, Jesus, Dweet, you better have fucking bor- You do have borrow time, good boy. Wow, she's really chasing me, really? No, okay. That's escape. That is an escape. Oh, cool. Well, Dweet's dead. Long live the Dweet. Heal up. Hopefully she doesn't have fucking no ed. Let's find an actual staircase to go down because I don't want to wait. She doesn't have no ed. That's nice. What? Where are you? So I pallet stunned her twice. Oh, I'm oblivious. So oh, she's over there. Pallet stunned her twice. We won a, a lot of chases, technically. So she's absolutely gonna come over here, right? God, really, dude? Damn, let her come over here and chase me, please. Let's say, where's the fucking pallet over here? Hello? Oh god, you're actually, uh, yeah, okay. Hey, Ace, you better, um... You're fucking full health, bud. Oh, she already broke that door, cool. Uh, so... Hey, that's almost full! That was almost full! I'm not gonna believe it, though, because it's a fucking lie!
Now would be a good time for the Michaela to have, um, to have Unbreakable. Are you stuck? And if I could hit these, like, at a rhythmic pace, imagine? We could have gotten out. Oh, I don't feel confident about this match. I was until, uh, fucking Homeboy Ace, for whatever fucking reason, just decided to fucking dive hook. What? Huh? I mean, I lost the chase twice. That should only be. Oh, God, I don't feel confident. I don't feel confident because how these emblems fucking work. I just do not feel confident at all anymore. Nope. Nope. Were we close? Yeah. Yeah, we were. What more do you want? <laughs> I'm fucking dead serious here. What more could you actually fucking ask for, game? I, I, I'm, I don't know. I'm at my fucking wit's end. Well, like, <sighs> we won what? Five chases. That means nothing. Cause if that's only 20 points or whatever this stupid shit is, it's lying, by the way. These are not correct stats. Because your starting value for Evader is 100, not 11. Unless we're just going by 10s and cutting off a zero at the end. Whatever. Stealth is not that big of a bonus, apparently. Stealth means fuck all. It literally just calculates how close you are to them in their terror radius. Chase is one. Okay, that should be a 200 then, if we're going by that, or th or maybe even higher. We got two pallet stuns, that's 50 each, that's 100. So, oh, just tell me the right stats, fucking please. You lose a chase, that's minus 10. M losing a chase is getting hit in the chase, that's losing it. You lose 10. I lost two chases, I got down twice, unless it's cumulative? Which would mean that I lost 40 points, which is why- Oh my god, I fucking hate this. This shit is so- Did I have fun? Fuck you, Kote. That's- that's my response to you. You're- you owe me money. That is what I will say. You owe me dollars. I paid 10 bucks for the fucking battle pass. Sorry, the rift. I paid 10 bucks for this shit, because it has good shit in it. And you're literally- putting it behind a fucking wall. If this was just get gold quality three times, it'd be done, I'd be completed, we wouldn't have this con conversation. We'd be doing fun stuff instead of raging at your stupid shitty game. You have to be fucking kidding me. There's no way anybody in their sane brain said, that's a good idea, let's do that. No fucking way. None. No fucking way. I don't even have a Gideon Meat plan offering, so I can't even bring us there. I just gotta hope and pray we get a, a, a killer map, an indoor map. Fuck, man. My eye is twitching. That should not be the experience when playing a fucking video game. Sorry, Kote, you failed. But hey, you still think you're doing a good job, so there's that, I guess. I hate this. I hate this. Absolutely. I'm gonna do it off screen as a killer. That's what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna do it off screen as a killer. What? I don't know what you want from me, game, okay? I don't fucking know. I don't know what you fucking want from me. No fucking clue. No fucking clue. This game is the most buggy piece of shit I've ever played. And I played Silent Hill Downpour. You gotta be fucking kidding me. You gotta be fucking kidding me. The emblem system has to be bugged. If they came out tomorrow and be like, oh fuck man, sorry mate. This shit's bugged. 
I would believe them in a heartbeat. There's no way this shit is- no. No, fuck you. Fuck you, behavior. This shit is unplayable! This shit is unplayable. You're literally forcing people to fucking do shitty glyph challenges, two of them, and fucking play ten games in a row where they kill the obsession by any means. You don't know what the fuck you're doing, just admit it. I'm, I'm glad this next patch is looking like a banger because this is not a shining example of what this game could be. No, not even fucking close. Oh yeah, this one's fine. Drop a pallet while being chased or break pallets. That's that's good. That's perfect. Yeah, go get gold. Lightbringer or gatekeeper. Okay. Silver, unbroken devout. Bronze of benevolent and malicious. You don't have to up the quality. You realize that. You can have this be get three gold quality, benevolent or malicious. Fine. Get three gold quality, unbroken devout. Fine. This one doesn't change. This one should absolutely be get three gold quality evader or chaser emblems. I don't, I don't know what you're fucking trying to get at. I don't- I have no fucking clue. Like, in my near future, it's commune with five red glyphs or... No, because this path is shit. I don't- I'm not bringing a Mori. I don't bring shit that I don't like playing against. Sorry, get fucked, Kote. Looks like I'm destroying drop pallets, I guess. Drop pallets, hit 20 survivors with feral, in the feral frenzy in a trial? That's not hard. Carry somebody 300 meters? That ain't hard. Earn blood points? Cool. Glyph? Get fucked, but I guess I have to. And escape as Jeff? Cool. Get fucked, behavior. Absolutely, 100%, undignified, get fucked. That'll do it for this episode. I can't, I can't take this anymore. This is, this is, this, this is getting close to be the straw that broke the camel's back here. Man, I was enjoying, enjoying my time in the game, completing challenges, hell yeah, and then this one is what is killing the enjoyment. So, get fucked. Behavior, Kote, every dev on the team, Almo, you're still there, uh, fucking Patrick is definitely still there, get fucked. So, I wanna thank you all for watching, if you enjoyed this Rage Fest. Uh, hook the like button, more subscribe button, bing bong that bell, and until next time, I will see you in the fog, hopefully on greener pastures and better mood. Good luck, me.